Hey everybody, um, it was a rough night last night, so I got home, I'm really tired, it was my Monday, so I'm just completely whipped, but I still got to come up with a yummy dinner for myself. So I decided to use one of these Extreme Wellness 100% Whole Wheat um, Wraps. Uh, I actually like the sprouted ones because they've got less carbs, but this is not bad for one of these wraps. It's 70 calories, only 2 grams of fat, um, a total of 10 net carbs, got a lot of fiber, 6 uh, grams of fiber, and 4 grams of protein, and uh, they're, they're pretty sizable, I mean they're bigger than my hand. So I've got some turkey meat and I'm going to um, mix it in with some taco seasoning and I'm going to make a 6 or 7 ounce taco that I'm going to be able to eat. Um, so it's going to be lean turkey, maybe some salsa, uh, a little bit of sour cream maybe, some lettuce, and one of these uh, fairly low carb whole wheat um, wraps. And I'm going to, you know, they're flimsy right now, but I'm going to try to air fry it to firm it up, and then uh, stuff it, and then finish it off at the air fryer. So stay with me and let's see how it comes out. So this is going to be a sleepy time, uh, down and dirty, really quick video. I've already explained about the Extreme Wellness 100% Wheat um, wraps. They've got uh, 10 net carbs, uh, 70 calories per each one, and fiber is like 6. So anyway, what I did was I took one of these and I put it in the air fryer and I just flipped it over like that and got the air fryer here still hot but I flipped it down in that and I left it at 400 degrees for five minutes so after I did that I got a kind of a leathery um, wrap kind of firm and uh, I'm good with that. So, what I'm going to do is now I'm going to load it up with some um, turkey meat. I'm going to bring it over to the stove because it's going to be a little bit easier. And I'm just going to put some ground turkey meat with taco seasoning in there. I'm going to load it up. I'm going to weigh this out too, but uh, right now it doesn't feel like much of anything. But that is a hearty looking meal. So let's get the scale over here. Got the scale set. I'm going to put a paper plate down, zero it out. I'm going to throw that taco thing right down on there, and it's six ounces. We're still doing good. I'm tired, but uh, it's going to be kind of like empty the fridge out of some stuff a little bit. I've got some roasted pepper strips that I'm just going to put down in there. Why not? And then I've got some four cheese Mexican. And I'm going to lay some of that right in there. Kind of get it around on the inside, the outside. Just throw it in. Okay, so now the total weight is 8 ounces. So I've got the air fryer and I am going to line it. with some still hot from cooking that tortilla. I'm just going to kind of line it in there. And then I'm going to set this taco shell right down. And I'm going to drop this back in the air fryer for probably about five minutes at 400 degrees. So it's been five minutes at 400 degrees. It is hot, hot, hot. 
but let me take the foil out here. It is a crispy, crispy taco. So, let's get this on a plate. And I'm going to add a little bit of salsa to this. So a little bit of salsa. I use my little injector here and I'm going to inject a little bit of sour cream. some lettuce and kind of tuck it right in there make it nice and neat Wow and there we have got a quick dinner time taco with a crispy shell Let's give it a try. Ah, oh, nice and firm. Look at that taco. It's going to be, it's going to be messy. There's no two ways about it, but it's probably going to be really good. So let's give it a shot. Mm. Nice and crispy. Let me get in there and get a little more meat. Mmm. Tacos are so good. The wrap firmed up really nice. I mean, you got the fresh lettuce, the turkey, the ground turkey when you put the seasoning in. I challenge you to tell the difference between that and ground beef. So much leaner and it's so, so good. I mean, look at that. That is like cheesy goodness. This is like blows Taco Bell out of the water. I wasn't really a big Taco Bell fan, but I mean, I like tacos. But, wow. Mmm. Oh, my. Are those peppers? It's just so good. Okay, one more bite, and I'm going to put it down. Oh my goodness. Mm. Well, I guess you could call this an air fried taco. Um, only took a, excuse me, only took a few minutes to prep. Wow. The only hard thing is it's so spicy, I added some extra cumin and chili powder. A little bit of Cajun seasoning to the mix, so it's pretty hot. And I'm not supposed to have water or anything to drink 20 minutes after. 20 minutes before, 20 minutes after, so it could be a long 20 minutes after I finish this. But anyway, I hope you try it. It's quick, it's easy. Um, look for the sprouted 
ones, look at the carb count on the back. The sprouted ones are like all, even half the carbs of this. And they taste absolutely great. Uh, really good ingredients. I don't have my uh, glasses on. But, uh, yeah, okay. Anyway, uh, olive oil, flaxseed, whole wheat, um, no sugar added, no cholesterol, high in fiber, zero trans fat, no hydrogenated oils. And, like I said, they're flimsy, the wraps. But you fold it in half in the air fryer, and it firms up. And as long as your meat isn't soaking wet when you put it in, it's kind of like absorb the liquid and cool down a little bit, it's perfect. Mmm. I'm sorry, I'm hungry. Last night for, for dinner at my cruise where I had a yogurt and some little cup of uh, chicken salad. So this is my dinner and I'm glad to have it with you today. So give them a shot. Like I said, I got those wraps at Big Y. Mm. All right. Let me go, so I gotta slow down. Anyway. Give it a try. Quick dinner. You got your picky family at home? Have them wrap it up and make burritos. Or you can air fry them some, some shells. But it's relatively a healthy taco. So please give it a try. Let me know what you think. And I hope you have, as always, a wonderful, fun-filled day. And uh, like we said, I had to come up with an ending phrase, but uh, kind of like what we said with the old ending obesity thing. Don't get hard down on yourself or anything uh, about the weight loss. It is a struggle. But you know what? Um, it's going to be worth it in the end. And we just keep moving forward. And don't worry about the fatty levers or the other issues that are going on in your life right now. All you can do is work forward and do your best to take care of it. Because we really don't know how much longer we have on this planet. And you never know when your number is going to be up. So let's make the most of every day. And uh, have a bright future. And eat tacos. Love you all. We'll see you uh, later.